How do you say that? Yeah, no, no. D-U-E-R-S-T. Did you remember Durst is the worst? Ah! Durst the worst, bitch! <laughs> Durst the worst, bitch! 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 Everybody's kind of like, well, okay, well, you know, it's Friday night or it's Saturday night. You know, it's, it's just trying to keep partying. No, we can't keep partying because we'll wake up with nothing in a minute. <laughs> you know what I mean? As a whole. If y'all got a smartphone, take a picture. Could I get your smartphone? Are you with us on this democracy? What do you mean? Well, you, you remember, there we go, yes. You remember lame duck, right? Republican lame duck, they cut the powers of Tony Evers. Right. And so I'm trying to get a car procession to say we don't agree with that. Oh, let me get this other one. I want to Wait. Have two of them. I mean, that way to give you gotta have two of them. Because one is the procession route, mm. and then one is the what's thing. So yeah. And uh so yeah, if you can take can one I get the picture you. with you, man? Yes, you can. Right, excellent. What did the lame duck what do you what is the lame well, duck? Well the lame about? duck was a Republican signed in a, a, a number of laws yeah. to stop Tony Evers from having the power to do certain things in the, the governorship which is affecting us all. Do you think that in general, the government should have less power just across the well, board? Well, yeah, well, we can we can hope for that. Yeah. But you know what I mean, come on. I mean, that is a piece of- <laughs> what, kind of what, what kind of policies is he not able to do now? Like what kind of- Well, one, he's not gonna be able to address some critical issues in the inner city. In the inner city? Job creation. Right, yeah. Yeah, job creation, a, a procession, against the I would say job creation is a huge, a huge issue, yeah. You know, and so, down, if you got a smartphone, take a picture of it, circle it, and what's that? I want person, yes, I need help. And the thing is, we need to get the word out. We need to start somewhere. Now, beyond this, what I'm thinking, and which I've already got blown away for this one from the IRS, because I'm advocating us not paying taxes. There you go. Holding back our tax. That's the only one, bro. I haven't paid yeah, yet, so hey, maybe I will, dude. I don't know, dude. They sent me a letter. Take too much. They sent me a letter saying, we're going to sue you in seven days if you don't pay your property tax. They just right. sent me that letter. Yeah. So they already got, see, I got uh, over at my shop, I got the signs up over there. But so that's what I'm saying. This here is just to, you know, get people together. You see, and if they could get together, we can change that. Another question. Yes. Do you get enough people? Come on through. You, you, okay. Okay. Go ahead. Do you get enough people together? How are you gonna a let them know that this you got enough that this is happening when it's happening? You know all that. Well, that's why I got that there. The number. See. You know, oh yeah. And everyone will message contact. you. You'll there we go. Back. Yes. We, yes, we will. And uh, like okay. I said, as we give people more interested, such as yourself, you took the number down. You all contact. Me. Whose number? That's your number. Okay, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's my number. Oh, okay. And yeah, you're that's okay my number. With that number being yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 That's that's that's. I just want to make okay. On this side, like... see the Expressions Journal with me. I don't know if y'all can remember. Expressions Journal. Like I can remember y'all years ago. Uh, Mike and them used to stand out here and sell the Expressions Journal, and so that's who I am. And so I'm a pro democracy media today, and uh, so the thing is. We just gotta get, we, we gotta, we, we, man, we gotta say something about this. And we gotta let, it's not just even for us, but we gotta let people across the nation know that we ain't just happy with this. Because if they think we're just happy with this, I'm a direct descendant of the slaves out of Arkansas. They'll do anything to you. If they was able, the Republicans were able to, oh, I mean, did you remember what they said? The minute uh, Tony Evers was elected, you know what they said? We don't trust Tony Evers. Mm -hmm. What? I mean, what kind of politics is it? We don't trust them. Yeah. I mean, now you're hitting up the man on, you know, who he is? Oh, we're going to sign in a bunch of laws. You know, they signed in a bunch of laws lessening his ability to govern. Well, that's robbing, that's robbing the voter. That's robbing us. We didn't pay for that. I mean, we didn't vote for that. We don't work and pay taxes for that. And that's why I'm advocating, see, I'm advocating rent strikes, I'm advocating uh, not paying your taxes, I'm advocating traveling around to the different states or our neighboring states who Wisconsin does more business and telling them to boycott them until they change it. So I'm talking, this is the light like stuff I, like, I got out here. I like the tax boycott, yeah, dude. Yeah, because it'll work. I very much do it, like oh, that. Oh man, man, I've had that out for about <laughs> four I'll weeks over what. at my shop. 
And I tell you, I got a letter from the IRS saying because I was back on my property tax because I used the money to be out here with the walker, boat walker out. And they said, we give you, we gonna give you four weeks to pay all your taxes because they figure I'm doing that already, withholding my taxes because of the situation. So the thing is, we just got to be up on it. But aren't you going to share this on social media, guys, and see? Sure, why not? Yeah, I, I mean, I might, I'll, I'm gonna go get some uh, bite, a bite, and then I'll be coming back around. Well, you don't want to take a picture of it. I will. No, I will. I will though, for sure. Well, for sure. why won't you do it right now? I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm just saying, you might forget. Back. <laughs> I might not be here. I've been out here since. 12. I think. I. Oh damn! Wow. Yeah, I've been out here since. You committed, 12. huh? Yeah, I know Michael Moore. Yeah, he did all those videos yeah. with us. Uh, so there's uh, this one documentary where he travels the world from yeah. country to country to see Asia. Everybody deserves to be listened to at least. Right. Yeah. What they did to fix it. Um, I personally believe in this. But okay, country. you can do it, Doc. You want to do it later. Um, I personally believe in this country, our government needs to be overthrown completely and started from the ground up. So okay. you should watch that. Um, it's so interesting. That's what they did in a couple countries. It's a risky thing to do. I mean, you it could fail, but... <coughs> well, wait, 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 wait. Let me say something. Let me say something. <coughs> that is exactly what has happened in Wisconsin. Yeah, it does. The Wisconsin oh. government was overthrown by the Republicans who were brutally defeated yeah. in the election. They didn't know what hit them. They didn't know what hit them. The Tea Party was crushed. Man, that sounded you know so what I mean? Weird. They were totally destroyed. I mean, they waited until 2.30 on November 7th to say, we lost. Yeah, I don't know where the Tea Party's at. They're long. They're destroyed. They're old news, I think. Dude, they were destroyed. Well, look at, maybe. I don't know. Hey, maybe the guy in Michigan, about. hey, on the day of the election, he said, oh, Scott Walker will win everything. Oh, we can rely on Scott Walker. Well, Scott Walker lost. Yeah, yeah. The whole Wisconsin Tea Party collapsed. And this is another way to say it. The whole great white hope was called. Oh, Jesse Lee Peterson no, says Scott that? Scott Walker was the white hope. Oh, I thought you were talking no, about Trump. No, Scott Walker was Trump. supposed to be. No, Scott Walker was going to be the next president. Oh, no, yeah. Scott Walker. You remember? He was going to be the next president. Yeah. Uh, hey, when I first came out here boy, uh, trying to get him out of office, Everybody was saying, oh, Scott Walker's got this money. Oh, everybody likes Scott Walker. Oh, Scott Walker got friends. Uh, his, his, yeah, hey, Scott Walker's my uncle. I was like, I don't, I don't give a shit. He's got to go. <laughs> so I spent hundreds of hours voting him out, uh, trying to get him out. Madison, uh, Racine, Waukesha, all through the north side. <laughs> and so I'm saying, that he was the white hope. And he lost brutally. They didn't know what hit them. <laughs> Trump changed it. Listen, when Walker lost, Trump stopped wearing red. He started wearing blue. Because Trump ain't nothing but a businessman. Yeah. That's all Trump, he don't want to be around nobody who's losing. <laughs> <laughs> Including Scott Walker. Oh, excellent, sir. <laughs> Oh, we're going to get so, yeah. out of here today. And, and, okay, yes. And I, just, I, I, I felt this Peace was important to come yes, and say exactly. hello. Hey, even if you don't come back, spread the uh, word. All right, all right, for yeah. sure. Yeah. I will definitely spread the word. Whoa. Hey, who's that? Hey, how's it going, dude?